This year's winner of the Cartier Daily Telegraph Award of Merit really epitomizes everything that this unique award represents. He demonstrated his talent in the saddle with nine jockeys championships in Ireland and 25 Group 1 winners. But besides all of that remarkable prowess on the track, he is an absolutely outstanding human being. Now, since receiving a diagnosis of pancreatic cancer last year, he's not only bravely fought the disease, but he's also decided to help others facing the same situation as himself. My lords, ladies and gentlemen, the Cartier Daily Telegraph of Ward of Merit goes to Pat Smullen. Didn't take much time to write a speech, but uh, I'll give it a go. Um, what an honour it is for me to stand here before such an illustrious crowd of people that have achieved so much in what I believe is the greatest industry that there is. And uh, I would like to thank Laurent and Cartier, uh, the Daily Telegraph, and indeed to you, Harry, for an amazing night that uh, has given me great pleasure to be here. Um, I've been so fortunate all through my life to have done something that I truly loved. And it's, um, you know, I, I, I really think it in the present moment that we should really appreciate what we have and what a great industry it is. And, you know, it, I have got to travel the world, share a room with people such as yourselves, um, and meet great people tr all down through the, through the years. And that was only achievable by one thing, and that was the horse. Horses are my life, have been my life, and you know, I just want to pay tribute to the winners tonight who are truly the equine athletes. Again, I, I've been fortunate to, be, to have encountered great people all the way down through my life, and you know, to work for Dermot Weld, all his owners, um, and, you know, one, I, I don't like singling out people, but my Glare Stud and, and the Hefner family have been so good to me throughout my career and more so in the last two years. They've been so supportive and uh, I'm very grateful to, to everybody for that. Um, other than that, it's just been, you know, what I've had to face in the last two years has been obviously very difficult, but... It's given me great pleasure, and, and I'm hugely proud of what we achieved on Champions Weekend. Um, HRI, uh, Long Jeans Champions Weekend Committee, gave me the opportunity to do what I wanted to do, and that was to raise awareness of pancreatic cancer, to, to uh, raise much-needed funds. And we got to do that in spades, and it's going to make a huge difference to a lot of people's lives going forward, and uh, that's something that I'm very, very proud of. But something that I'm equally as proud of is that, again, when in the time of need, what a great industry. I mean, what people have done and continue to do to help me, to support me, and to support my cause in what is fighting pancreatic cancer is so humbling and something that uh, I, I think people don't realize how, how important it is that, that this great industry that we all work in and that we should protect in the present atmosphere, you know, the challenges that we face at the, at the present time, that we all rally together and protect that. And what can be achieved, I think we showed over Champions Weekend that it is, we showed racing in a very, very positive way. And that is, a, is equally as... Uh, important to me is what we did for the cancer research and, and trials. Um, I just really want to thank Cartier again. Uh, I really, I looked at the, the list of past winners and I feel very inadequate to be totally honest with you to be receiving it, but uh, it's, it's greatly received and I'm truly honored and proud to accept it and thank you very, very much. <laughs>